Now, let me show you the best way to use ChatGPT to make money. So the first thing I did was I went to my key search tool. I put in Shopify. I want to shop and look at the whole domain, All right? As you notice here, it says we have 491,000 530 keywords. Well, that's too many. So let's go ahead and add some filters. Watch this. So I'm going to go. I want to make sure that something is at least searched out a thousand times and that it has at least a thousand uh, times of traffic. OK, so let's go ahead and hit filter and see what we come up with. Watch this. Now, notice this. We've got volume. We've got traffic. We've got some CPC information and then we have where it is. But I'm going to go ahead and scroll down. I'm going to find out what seems to be doing the best. All right. So we got fashion branding. OK, that's one thing. It's got a thousand here. It's got traffic of a thousand. It's got volume of. OK, so let's keep on going. Side hustles. These are getting us close to what we then are going to eventually do using chat. GPT. Watch this. So let's see how to blog. Okay. All right. That's interesting. Prospecting meaning. Okay. What's going on there? All right. So let's go down and find something particular. Life motivation. Look at that. 22,200 times it's being searched out. 6,562 times that it's being searched on Shopify. So, okay, that's interesting. That's getting us a little bit closer, right? Well, we're looking at e-commerce platforms. So we, what we can do here is find out some of the best e-commerce platforms. Now, there's multiple ways that we're going to start thinking about this, right? Creative business ideas, creating a business, a brand name. Hmm. That's getting us closer. This is becoming even more interesting. So that gets you thinking, OK, if I'm being if people are being are searching out creative business ideas, then it means they may they must be needing something else once they come up with a creative business idea. So that gives us an opportunity and I'll show you here in a second how we can create something that then gets them closer to what they want. These are all as we look at this, these are all problems people are having because they're searching it out. And if they're on Shopify, these are things that people have and are searching for. So creative business ideas. We've talked about that creating a brand name. OK, that's being searched out 1300 times. But we got an overall search volume of 4400. The key here is that we are searching for things that people are looking for and not the other way around. All right. Low investment business ideas. Hmm. What if we put in business names. Let's try that. If I can spell it right. Business names. Let's try that keyword. Go ahead and hit filter. Now I'll give you and show you what uh, keyword tool I am using. It's really, really cool. You're going to like it. It's super inexpensive, but good business names. Look at this. 8,100 times being searched for it, and they're getting 2,900 and uh, 2,394 in searches, right? All right, so now that's interesting. Business name generator. So now this is what we're going to do next. We've got some decent traffic. We're going to then go over to Chat GPT and do this. Now I've already done it, but I want to show you. Look at this. What I then asked is, I says, hey, listen, create me a screen. PHP script to use to generate a business name. And voila, look what happened here. Isn't that beautiful? Now, we now have something that we can create that people are already searching for. It's proven that they're already searching for. And what I'm going to do coming up is I'm going to show you how to grab a landing page, a really, really easy one. Put it on the landing page, put a little bit of narrative behind it, and we're going to use ChatGPT to do that as well.